The Faculty of Medicine at the University of Toronto has exceptional research programs supervised by distinguished scientists. These programs are internationally recognized and discovering new knowledge about health and disease is a shared activity between faculty supervisors and their graduate and postdoctoral students. In the last 10 years, several new buildings and research towers have been built by the university and by its fully affiliated teaching hospitals and research institutes to accommodate our growing needs. This means that many of our graduate students have new state-of-the-art research space and access to new equipment to be able to carry out innovative life sciences and biomedical research in basic sciences, translational research, and healthcare clinical research. As a prospective graduate student, I was interested in a program in which I would gain a depth of knowledge in my specific research area but also a breadth of knowledge in the biomedical field as a whole. I felt that the University of Toronto was the perfect place to do this. My project has a heavy human component as I measure various biomarkers in human serum. So the close proximity of U of T to the hospitals in the downtown core make my research that much easier to facilitate. Because of the vast resources available here at the University of Toronto, I was able to accelerate my discovery of a long non-coding RNA that controls blood vessel formation and quickly find its therapeutic potential in the most common and malignant form of adult brain cancer called glioblastoma multiforme. So one of the things that's changing right now in medical research is that we're really in the midst of uh, a technical renaissance, if you will. And our research is finally in a place where we can translate this into cures and therapies. I used to work in a biotech company, and so I know that this is a very exciting way to do research. I worked at the new facility at St. Michael's Hospital, part of the Toronto Academic Health Sciences Network. And my supervisor was a medical doctor conducting fundamental molecular research. I study low oxygenation in the tumor microenvironment. Certain oxygen-sensitive signaling pathways induce subsets of proteins that stimulate cellular responses and manifest as a more aggressive tumor phenotype and thus poor patient prognosis. In investigating this, I've had the privilege of working with a world-class team of researchers and contributing to a high-impact research publication. When I finally decided to go back to school to do my PhD, it was imperative that I surround myself with scientists from fields other than my own. I wanted to learn in an environment that thrives on interdisciplinary science, and I found that at the Faculty of Medicine, University of Toronto. I picked U of T for grad studies because I knew it was an environment where I could thrive. I have plenty of opportunity to meet international scientists and generate collaborations. I chose the University of Toronto for my graduate education because Toronto is home to a one-of-a-kind research community. The university's affiliations with the research hospitals and institutes creates a hub of knowledge at the downtown core. One of the things that attracted me to U of T as a faculty member after having been in biotech for a few years was that I knew that U of T attracts the best students. And these students often have the privilege of being supervised by internationally renowned scientists. Even though these scientists are, are speaking in multiple international venues, these scientists are actually on the ground training U of T students. They're leading their uh, committee work, they're teaching in their classrooms, and they're mentoring their projects. And this is really the norm at U of T, and I think that's what makes U of T quite a special place. As a result of being supervised by a practicing physician who also does excellent biomedical research, my research project has a direct focus on how we can use science to really change the way patients are treated. Because I want to put together the fields of mathematics, computation, and neuroscience, it's very important for me that I have a strong and balanced uh, background and mentorship. My supervisor is an expert in her field and has a unique interdisciplinary background. I trained and mentored by top-notch scientists and clinicians, but I was given the opportunity to expand my skill set beyond my scientific expertise to include intellectual prop property filings, business development, as well as strategic management planning. I have found a true community here at the University of Toronto. The Faculty of Medicine departments each have their own student organization. 
that really make the graduate experience enhanced for each of the graduate students. Right away, you feel a sense of community from all of the social events, networking opportunities, and intramural sports teams that you can take part in. U of T is also located in a very multicultural city with lots of beautiful neighborhoods and really great food. Although I did consider other options for grad school, I ultimately decided to stay here. Um, and that was mainly because I had such an amazing experience during my undergrad doing research here. So as I approach the end of my PhD, um, I am looking towards the future to doing a career in academics. I have a few offers from, uh, for postdoctoral positions. We take great pride in our students and their accomplishments, both while they're graduate students and once they leave us for their chosen careers in areas such as the biotech industry, the pharmaceutical industry, academic institutions, professional schools, and many other associated career opportunities. Find what it is that you love to do and go for it. Surround yourself by motivated people who will mentor you and support you. Don't be afraid to talk to your professors, staff, and other students to help you along the way. Try to get an exposure to research by being in a summer undergraduate program or working with a faculty on a fourth year or a thesis project. When you're doing your postgraduate degree, don't forget to leave your desk every once in a while. Toronto's got thousands of restaurants and theater. Go out. A lot of the best science starts when you're just sitting around with your friends brainstorming new ideas. We all want to have answers. It's our passion to learn, and grad school drives you to do just that. 